Did you know some creators are making thousands of dollars every month using AI consistent character? They use them to make books on Amazon and Etsy or create faceless videos on TikTok, YouTube and Instagram. But let's be honest, generating consistent characters across multiple scenes is not easy. Most AI tools struggle to maintain the same face, style and outfit. Even with a strong prompt, it can be super frustrating and time consuming. In this video, I'm going to show you the easiest way to get characters for your project without spending a dime. Before we dive in, can you please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up? It's totally free for you, but it makes a big difference for me. Thank you so much. The first tool I'm going to show you is getemg.ai. It's great for generating unique and consistent characters using existing images. Before discovering this tool, I used to write long complex prompts hoping to get the same character look every time. But that process was slow frustrating and often gave me random results. But now I just upload an image and this tool does the magic. Here's how it works. Go to Google or a free stock image site, search for a character you like, funny little boy, superhero girl, or even your favorite anime character. Select a clean full body image of your character with good lighting and minimal background. Take a screenshot of your character and save it on your computer. Once you have the image of your reference character, go to getemg.ai, select image variation. Upload the image or the screen short of your reference character here. The AI will analyze it and give you new versions of the same character. If you're not happy with the result, repeat the process until you get one you like. After downloading the image, go back to the home page of getimg.ai and select the background remover option. Upload the generated image of your character here. The AI will instantly remove the background of your image. As you can see, now your character is clean and ready to be used. This AI tool generate images in the size of the screenshot or image provided. To make sure you have the right size for your video, go to canva.com, click create a design and select custom size. Use these dimensions. The first for TikTok, YouTube short and Instagram reels. The second for YouTube long form video. Click here and upload your background free image. Place it on the design and resize it as desired. Once you're done, click here to download. Now let's animate your character. To do so, go to Hilo AI and click on create video, select image to video. Upload your character image here and enter a short and clear prompt. For example, selling fruits at the village street market, 3D anime Moana style or walking in the forest with a cute dog, 3D anime Moana style. Always include the style in your prompt to keep the visuals consistent. If you want two or three consistent character, repeat the same steps with the images of the other characters. Example, I'll use Jerry from Tom and Jerry and Shrek. Find a clear image of each character. Run it through getimg.ai for a variation and background removal. Add both characters to the same Canva design. Adjust the size of the characters and download the image. Upload that new image to Hilo AI. Use a prompt like walking in the forest, 3D anime, Moana style. This trick helps you keep multiple characters consistent across different scenes. It's perfect for storytelling and kids' YouTube videos. If you need to add a voice over to your video, click the link in the description below and it will take you to 11 labs. Click here and select text to speech. Select one of the voices in the library or clone your voice by clicking here. Enter your text here and then click here to generate. To combine your videos with the speech, use CupCat or any other editing tool. That's it for today. If you found this video helpful, go ahead and give it a like, subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification bell so you don't miss out on parts 2 and 3. Trust me, I've got even more amazing tools to show you that'll make this process even easier. I'd really love to hear your thoughts. Drop a comment below. Let me know what you think about this method or feel free to ask me anything. I'm always happy to help. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.